So now I know for like ever now that a Banjo Kazooie remake was supposed to be like in the works on and off, and people have just been in and out of insiders just saying like it's supposed to come out soon or it's supposed to even be in development, but now I think we actually got some actual proof. Hey everyone, baseball, and today we're gonna be taking a look at potentially a new leak that came out with Banjo Kazooie. And this one seems a little bit more believable since it's an actual insider that's actually known for leaking stuff. Not just like anyone in the media, not just like anyone who, you know, was just on Twitter just leaking stuff. No, this was like an actual person. But if you do enjoy Banjo Kazooie content, anything Xbox, or just anything in general, just 3D platformers, consider subscribing since this is why I mainly talk about, and I really do appreciate it if you do, because we're getting really close to 100, and that's kind of my goal before the year, so thank you very much. So according to Reset Era, which is kind of a leaker, but also is a pretty big thing of itself too, he, I guess, stated that Sumo Digital is basically going to be the one that's going to be doing the remake of Banjo Kazooie, which I mean, makes sense. They had a lot of work with uh, Little Big Planet, and they just had their 3D platform around the PS5, which I heard was pretty good, so I trust them with it. And then what basically is that what the main problem was with what's been going on with the whole Banjo Kazooie remake thing? was Microsoft is really just trying to find that team to actually, you know, do the game. They tried doing Rare, I guess, and they just want to work on their own stuff. And Double Fine has said multiple times that they also want to work on their own stuff. Same thing as, like, their other companies are there. Like, I'm pretty sure if they just go up to, like, the Halo d developers, yeah, they're going to want to work on their own stuff. But basically, they can't really find anyone, and they can't really force anyone to do it. But they actually found a team now to actually make the remakes and i think this one is sort of sticking which is definitely a good thing because this company definitely knows what they're doing and they're good with platformers so again they are probably the right team to go with this but the real question is do we even believe in the leak or anything or do we think this thing has credibility i mean yeah i kind of trust reset era and what they do and what they pretty much do for what they are i guess is the best way to put it is they're believable and they've gotten a lot of stuff right before so this is definitely one to definitely go off of but let me know what you guys think do you guys think that there's a chance of these two coming back and will they ever see the light of day and what do you want to see from banjo kazooie remake or even just a collection or even just like a new game in general because i know that three is probably one of the most requested games out there and i know a lot of fans definitely wanted that like and then subscribe all right i'll see you